So I've been testing this phone for a while now, but I haven't put it to test drastically. I mean, I haven't used it to um, play heavy duty games on it. And I hear you saying, well, you've showed us everything that you haven't shown us on field playing games yet. And that's what this video is all about. So without further ado, let's jump straight into it. Whenever I get a new phone in my hand, I try heavy duty games like Asphalt, Call of Duty and all of that. And I've now downloaded three of those games, PUBG Mobile, Shadow Fight 4 and Call of Duty, obviously Call of Duty. I haven't downloaded Asphalt yet, but that's something maybe for a next video. This is just to show you how snappy this phone is. So we know it has the new Snapdragon 8 Gen, but how, but how does it perform in real life? So. Let's go ahead and see how snappy this game is. As you see, the graphics look amazing with its 120 hertz refresh rate display. So let's go and don't allow that. And mind you, I this phone is now at 9%. And I deliberately kept it at 9% just to see how fast that battery life will go down while um, playing those heavy duty games. So let's go in guest mode. And no, I don't want to connect with that email weapon. And as you see here, this is just the player mode. They just showing me how to play these games. And look how fast this is. This is just amazing. Those color, the color accuracy of this phone is just top notch. I'm amazed how well those people at Samsung put in all the resources to give us this phone. I mean, we get to see that crease on the middle. It's kind of, it's not that visible when you're playing your games. And believe me, if you're holding this phone for about a couple of hours, you don't even see it after a while. So yeah, if I just fold it right, like here, if I flip it, you get to see that, that crease, but that's not that dramatic. So let me just reload here. And it's, it's very snappy. I've played Call of Duty on various iPhones and I can say for sure I'm amazed on how good the gameplay is here. And let's see, I haven't played it for a while and now it's at 8%. So yeah, obviously the battery, oh, the display was cranked all the way up. So that's something you need to know. I have that Bluetooth on, the Wi-Fi is on obviously, the display brightness is up at 100% and still I can play multiple games without it having crashed and that's the power of uh, the Snapdragon 8 Gen model. So it's something I do like about this thing. No, don't allow it for now. Deny. It's obviously it's a, a flagship phone so you do expect all that from it. But to have a snappy phone like this and you can do multiple things. So now I'm playing and all of a sudden I want to take a picture from something. I can just open that camera and I don't know, maybe, yeah, take a picture. And at the same time, at the same rate, uh, at the same rate, go back and open that game I've been playing. So yeah, it's now, it's now downloading. That's something. That's annoying sometimes if you've downloaded a heavy duty game. After downloading that game, you need to wait for a couple of minutes before it prepares its resources. So that's something that we need to deal with. But yeah, let's go in the meantime, see how Shadow Fight 4 does. And as you see here, I was playing it. I was playing in it just to see how it all goes. And as you see here, it goes right back to let me it goes right back to the place where i've left it so yeah i don't know it's not glitching it's not getting in even warm and i have now three games on and let's see how that battery does okay so it is at six percent but mind you it's not that i've started this phone at 100 percent this phone i haven't charged this phone for two days now uh, and i haven't been using it excessively so i need to be honest with that but still I have tested out just to make videos for you guys. I've made a ton of photos, videos with it. I've like played around with it just to see how the settings are and all of that. I've played a couple of games now and I have now three heavy duty games on like working in the background and still it plays like a charm. So if I go back to Call of Duty and it's right there where I left it. So yeah, that's the power of this phone. I love it. It's a quite good phone. 
maybe the one thing I, I don't love I don't like about it and I've said that in my previous video is the fact that it's quite thick when you flip it and it's kind of meant to flip it you're not gonna keep it like this especially if you buy a phone that that's meant to get flipped you're not keeping it like this obviously that way you you're protecting your screen from scratches and all of that while having it in your pocket but at the same time we need to deal with this thickness while flipping it while closing the phone so yeah for some people that's not something that bothers them maybe i'm the one uh, maybe i'm just too dramatic here about it but yeah so yeah i hope you've got something out of, out of this video i haven't played the game excessively i'm just showing you guys how, how, how the gameplay is and how snappy that is how how fast it responses on my uh, gestures so yeah that was it i hope you guys got something out of this video thanks so much for watching till the end i'll see you in the next one peace